Have you ever wondered what your next thought will be? It's a fascinating question. Our minds are constantly buzzing with thoughts. They come and go like clouds in the sky. But how often do we actually pay attention to them? This is where the power of observing your thoughts comes in. Observing your thoughts is like being a silent witness to your own mind. It's a practice that can transform your life. When you observe your thoughts, you create space between you and your thinking. This space is where true clarity and peace reside. By observing your thoughts, you gain a new perspective on your mind. You start to see patterns in your thinking. You notice recurring worries, fears and dreams. This awareness is the first step towards positive change. When you observe your thoughts, you're no longer at their mercy. You become the master of your mind, not its slave. So, are you ready to unlock the power of your mind? Our minds are like busy marketplaces. Thoughts come and go, shouting for our attention. Some thoughts are helpful, while others are not. But most of the time, we're not even aware of this constant chatter. We're so caught up in our thoughts that we forget we're not our thoughts. This mental noise can be overwhelming. It can lead to stress, anxiety and confusion. But what if we could step back and observe this chatter? What if we could see our thoughts for what they are, just thoughts? When we realise that our thoughts are not facts, we gain freedom. We no longer have to believe every worry or fear that crosses our mind. We can choose which thoughts to engage with and which to let go. It's like turning down the volume on a noisy radio. By understanding the mind's chatter, we open ourselves to a whole new world of possibilities. Try a little experiment. Close your eyes and say to yourself, I wonder what my next thought is going to be. Then become very alert and wait for the next thought. Be like a cat watching a mouse hole. What thought is going to come out of the mouse hole? Try it now. Eckhart Tolle, a renowned spiritual teacher, offers profound insights on observing thoughts. He encourages us to become the observer of our mind. This means stepping back and watching our thoughts without judgment. It's a simple yet powerful practice. This experiment reveals a profound truth. There's a, some, there's a space between our thoughts. In this space, we find our true self, the observer. This observer is not our thoughts or emotions. It's our pure awareness. When we tap into this awareness, we experience true peace. Toll's wisdom reminds us that we are not our thoughts. We are the consciousness that observes the thoughts. The veil of delusion is a concept that describes how our thoughts can cloud our perception of reality. It's like wearing tinted glasses that colour everything we see. Our thoughts, beliefs and past experiences create this veil. It distorts our view of the world and ourselves. Observing our thoughts helps lift this veil. When we step back and watch our thoughts, we see them for what they are. They're not absolute truths. They're just mental constructs. This realization is incredibly freeing. It allows us to see the world more clearly. Breaking free from the veil of delusion is a journey. It requires patience and practice, but the rewards are immense. As we observe our thoughts, we start to see patterns. We notice how certain thoughts lead to certain emotions and behaviors. This awareness gives us the power to change. When we break free from delusion, we experience life more fully. This is the gift of observing our thoughts. The step-by-step -step guide to thought observation. Observing your thoughts is a skill that anyone can learn. Here's a simple guide to get you started. First, find a quiet place where you won't be disturbed. Sit comfortably and close your eyes. Take a few deep breaths to center yourself. Now, turn your attention inward. Notice the thoughts that arise in your mind. Don't try to change or stop them. Just observe them. 
Imagine you're sitting by a river, watching leaves float by. Your thoughts are like those leaves. Let them come and go without getting caught up in them. As you practice, you might notice your mind wandering. That's perfectly normal. When you catch yourself getting lost in thought, gently bring your attention back to observing. Remember, the goal is not to have no thoughts. It's to be aware of the thoughts you have. With practice, this will become second nature. Mastering the art of mental clarity. Mental clarity is like a superpower. It allows us to see situations clearly and make wise decisions. When our minds are cluttered with thoughts, it's hard to think straight. But when we master the art of observing our thoughts, we gain clarity. Observing thoughts creates space in our minds. This space allows for new insights and ideas to emerge. It's like clearing the clutter from a room. Suddenly you can see the beauty of the space. As we practice thought observation, we become less reactive. We learn to respond to situations rather than react impulsively. This leads to better relationships and less stress. We're no longer at the mercy of our thoughts and emotions. We become the calm in the storm of life. Mental clarity also boosts creativity. When our minds are clear, we can tap into our innate wisdom and creativity. This is the power of mastering mental clarity through thought observation. A journey of self-discovery. Sarah's story. Let me tell you about Sarah, a successful entrepreneur who discovered the power of observing thoughts. Sarah had always been driven and ambitious, but she often felt overwhelmed and stressed. Her mind was constantly racing with worries about her business and personal life. One day, I attended a mindfulness workshop. There, I learned about observing thoughts. At first, I was skeptical. How could simply watching my thoughts make a difference? But I decided to give it a try. I started with just five minutes of practice each day. As weeks passed, Sarah noticed changes. She felt calmer and more focused. Her decisions became clearer. She was less reactive to challenges in her business. Sarah's journey of self-discovery through thought observation transformed her life. Her story shows the profound impact that observing thoughts can have on our lives. Overcoming challenges in thought observation. Like any new skill, observing thoughts comes with challenges. Many people find it difficult to sit still and watch their thoughts. Our minds are used to constant activity. When we try to observe, we might feel restless or bored. This is normal. It's part of the process. Another common challenge is judgment. We might start criticizing ourselves for having certain thoughts. Remember, the goal is to observe without judgment. All thoughts are welcome. They're neither good nor bad. They're just thoughts. Accepting this can be challenging but liberating. Some people worry they're not doing it right. They wonder if they should be feeling or experiencing something specific. There's no right or wrong way to observe thoughts. Everyone's experience is unique. The key is to be patient and kind with yourself as you learn. Even a few minutes of practice each day can make a big difference over time. The ripple effect of mindful thinking. When we observe our thoughts, the benefits extend far beyond our own minds. It's like dropping a pebble in a pond. The ripples spread outward, affecting all areas of our life. As we become more aware of our thoughts, we become more aware of our words and actions. We speak and act with greater intention. This leads to better communication and relationships. We become more empathetic and understanding of others. Our connections deepen and grow. The ripple effect also impacts our work life. With a clearer mind, we become more productive and creative. We handle stress better and make wiser decisions. This can lead to greater success and fulfillment in our careers. Our improved focus and clarity benefit not just us, 
but our colleagues and organizations as well. The mind-body connection is powerful and observing thought strengthens this connection. Practical tips for daily thought observation. Incorporating thought observation into your daily life doesn't have to be complicated. Start small, set aside just a few minutes each day for formal practice. You might do this first thing in the morning or before bed. Find a time that works best for you. Throughout the day, take brief moments to check in with your thoughts. You can do this while waiting in line, during your commute, or even while brushing your teeth. These micro moments of awareness can make a big difference over time. Use reminders to help you remember to observe your thoughts. You might set alarms on your phone or place sticky notes in visible places. These cues can help you build the habit of thought observation. Over time, it will become more natural and automatic. Every moment of awareness is a step towards greater clarity and peace. Transforming your life through awareness. Observing your thoughts is more than just a mental exercise. It's a pathway to transforming your entire life. When we become aware of our thoughts, we gain the power to change them. This awareness is the first step towards personal growth and transformation. As we observe our thoughts, we start to see patterns. We might notice negative self-talk or limiting beliefs that have been holding us back. Once we're aware of these patterns, we can choose to change them. We can replace negative thoughts with positive ones. We can challenge limiting beliefs and expand our possibilities. This transformation extends to our emotions and behaviours. When we observe our thoughts, we create a gap between stimulus and response. In this gap, we have the power to choose our reactions. Ultimately, observing thoughts transforms our relationship with ourselves and the world around us. We discover a sense of inner freedom that comes from knowing we are not our thoughts, but the awareness behind them. The science behind observing thoughts. The practice of observing thoughts isn't just ancient wisdom, it's backed by modern science. Neuroscientists have found that mindfulness practices, including thought observation, can actually change our brains. This is known as neuroplasticity, the brain's ability to form new neural connections. Studies have shown that regular mindfulness practice can increase grey matter in areas of the brain associated with learning, memory and emotional regulation. It can also reduce activity in the amygdala, the brain's fear centre. This leads to reduced stress and anxiety. Research has also found that observing thoughts can improve cognitive function. It enhances our ability to focus and pay attention. The evidence is clear. This simple practice can have profound effects on our brain and overall well-being. Your invitation to inner peace. You've learned about the power of observing your thoughts. You've discovered how it can transform your life, backed by both wisdom and science. Now it's time for action. This is your invitation to inner peace. Will you accept it? Start small. Set aside just five minutes today to observe your thoughts. Find a quiet place. Close your eyes. And watch the parade of thoughts in your mind. Don't judge them. Don't try to change them. Just observe. Notice how this simple act creates a sense of space and calm within you. As you continue this practice, you'll likely face challenges. You might get distracted or feel frustrated. That's okay. Each time you notice your mind wandering, it's an opportunity to practice returning to awareness. Every moment of observation is a victory. As you continue to observe your thoughts, you'll discover a deep well of peace within you. Thanks for joining us on this journey to observing your thoughts. If you found this video helpful, share your experience in the comments below. Don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe for more insightful content, and share this video with friends who might benefit from it.
Until next time, keep observing and stay mindful.